Good morning, everybody. This is It's Just Foods. We are back with another video. My hat that I'm wearing for this video is a nice White Sox White Dome, White Dome collection from Hat Club. Very clean hat. Simple gray UV, white gutter. Simple, clean. I like it. Cool. All right. All right. So, man, so as you can see, the title of the video, we are talking about my fitteds in Patterson, New Jersey, and White Plains, if you go to White Plains, New York. But uh, the original store is in Patterson, New Jersey. So we're gonna talk about it. So um, I I live in New Jersey, so I originally started going to my fitteds 2021. So like that's when I first got into hats early, like spring 2021 when I first started got into fit got into fitteds. I started going to Patterson uh my fitteds. And man, Patterson, uh my fitteds is dope, you know. The store, the vibes, I love the people. Shout out to Big Jersey, love the people in Patterson, New Jersey. Those are my guys, those are guys I always hang out with, talk to, etc. Coolest people you ever meet. So, all right. First six months when it comes to my fitteds. Uh, I can honestly say they weren't doing too hot. I, I can't lie. John Jay, owner of the store, designer, creator of the store. He has dropped some very good hats in the past, etc. I can honestly say this year has started a little wonky as far as the hats, the store coming out with a lot of hats that people are interested in. Now, granted, uh, John Jay does make a lot of different hats compared to other stores. Um, you will see some different designs. You won't see the same designs as you see from other stores. That's for sure. Most of the, most of the designs are unique to my fitteds. You will know that it's my fitteds hat, to be honest with you. Um, so as you can see, follow them on Instagram, my fitteds New Jersey. Most definitely check them out. So we're going to go through a few drops um, that kind of stood out and kind of like, I don't know, like the you guys tell me in the comments what you think. I'm curious on what you guys think of my face this year. When I was doing my ratings on my Instagram, they weren't too hot. A lot of people weren't feeling a lot of my fitness drops this year. Um, I've been to a, a few drops. A lot of times I go to uh, the My Fitness Drops, just hang out with the guys, etc. I don't really go there for a hat personally. Um, one of the better collections earlier this year, I can definitely say was this little pack of hats here, as you can see right here. I'm looking at it down here on my iPad. Now, if you look at these hats here, man, you have the Navy Pirates. Personally, I was waiting for that Navy Pirates, Navy PlayStation 1 inspired Pirates to come out for a while. So I'm glad that finally dropped. So I definitely had to cop that. Um, then they had the little teal or turquoise Pirates, White Sox. I mean, turquoise Pirates. I'm so addicted to White Sox, I keep thinking about it. But turquoise Pirates, that hat was decent. Um, but also one of the better hats in this collection was definitely the Barons. The Barons was super clean, super simple, green UV. That definitely sold out. Um, that Barons is really nice. So like a clean black crown, side patch was bussing, etc. It's a really nice hat. Now, I think this is definitely one of the better drops this year for sure. Not the best one so far, but definitely the better one for sure within the first six months. <clears throat> Now we got another one. So every time, you know, these hats drop, etc., there's always going to be a lot of variety, a lot of variety, a lot of different teams. Every time uh, a drop happens at MyFitties, everyone knows that if you're in the hat community you now. So the variety, what to choose from, what to pick is definitely different. But this drop here, uh, I will personally say that the Yankees was fire. Um, the De La Soul Mets was fire, uh, which is the brown crown. That one actually redropped. That one originally dropped sometime last year. That hat is definitely fire. And then you have the real tree. You know, there's this huge real tree trend. Um, now, granted, granted, personally, like I'm very picky when it comes to hats I like, um, hats that I enjoy, hats that I feel like I wear every day. I feel like as uh, fitted collectors, um, your style of what you like to wear may not be the same a year or six months from now. I can say personally, uh, my style of hat that I like is way different from how it used to be. I like clean, simple, not doing too much within the hat, the colors, the side pass, the logo, not doing too much. I feel like a lot of these hats tend to do too much to where they're not 
as wearable as hats from other stores. You know what I'm saying? Like the hats, like they're cool. Like they're cool to take a picture of. They're cool to have temporary. Say, look, this is the hat I got. But I feel like the, a lot of these hats aren't wearable and you may not like these hats three to four or, or even a year from now you know what i'm saying like you won't you won't like these hats from for so 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 with this drop right they dropped the white socks um i didn't care too much for it just because the lines is like granted very different from what i've seen etc it's just not a hat that i would wear which is why i didn't get it I collect White Sox hats, but that doesn't mean I collect every White Sox hat. Like you can collect a certain team, but that doesn't mean you have to cop every single hat that every store comes out with from that team. I only cop, I only collect wearable White Sox hats that I see myself wearing often. Like I don't like to collect hats and they just sit. I like to collect hats and they're gonna last a long time. So moving away. So, you know, this drop was decent. It wasn't too bad, it was whatever. So, all right, this pack of hats, I personally, so here's the thing. John Jay is the OG. Um, he dropped probably the best white dome collection a few years back, etc. So, you know, he's always gonna come out with some white domes. Now, uh, I can't rock with any of these. I don't, I don't care for them. They're not, they're not the greatest hats ever. I can't like that Mariners with the all-star game. No, I just, it's not the best hat. You know, I'm gonna just keep it honest. It's not, I personally wouldn't wear any of these, but again, everyone's style is different. Some people like them. So some people like that Mariners with the all-star game in the front. Houston Astros is decent. I'm not an Astros fan, go White Sox all day. Um, but yeah, so you know, these, these hats are okay, but, and granted, I'm sure, these hats probably sell out. People buy them because, again, everyone has different styles. Some of these hats, have, some of these hats sell out. A lot of people buy them. A lot of people resell them for a lot: two hundred, three hundred dollars, one fifty, whatever. You know, so pe pe people buy these hats. I just don't buy these hats. You know what I'm saying? Well, I just like to collection. This this collection wasn't the best. This this collection here, I feel like this was one of the better ones this year. Most definitely for sure. I heard a lot of people talking about the Bronx Bombers um, hat, hat. A lot of people were talking about this Bronx Bombers hat. I've seen a lot of people talking about it on social media. A lot of people wanted it. A lot of people were trying to see if there's any left in store, restocks, all that good stuff. You know what I'm saying? So a lot of people were talking about this hat. I think the one for this pack is the Barons. It was, I, sh I showed this Barons, the Barons with the white socks side patch. That hat is very clean, green UV. That's the that was the best hat out this pack. I don't care. That hat was fire. That hat is gas, 100%. That hat is gas. So that hat, I definitely respect. Um, you're always gonna see John Jay come out with Bisons. He is the OG curator of a lot of the minor league hats. And to be honest, his store and my fittings, they caused the most panic when it kept when it came to dropping bison hats. If you if you were in the community uh at the end of 2020 and 2021, you know what bisons did to the community. It caused a lot of panic. A lot of panic. John Jay dropped a few of the best minor league hats that people have seen that, that's come out. And that caused a lot of pain for people, man. Nowadays, it's a little bit different. And a lot of people that are new into the community don't know that. But I always give credit where credit is due. I can definitely say John Jay has caused the most panic when it can't when it comes to minor league hats for sure. But yeah, Barons, best hat out the pack. Barons, White Sox combo. Maybe you'll see one for me one day. Who knows? But definitely fire 100%. Now, this is what I really want to get to. June 10th, yo, June 10th, my guy Bones is dropping a three pack at My Fitness Patterson. Only at My Fitness Patterson. I hope you guys are there. It's gonna be a lot of fun, food, music. It's gonna be a lot of vibes, a lot of great people out there with hats, talking, collecting. Uh, I'm looking, I'm super excited for this day, man. He deserves it 100%. That's my guy. I met him literally my very first day at My Fitness. This drop is gonna be fire, so why not take a deeper look into the hats that he's dropping, all right? Makes sense, right? All right, Mets. Mets, this Mets was just posted yesterday. This Mets is fire, I fuck with it 100%. I think it's dope. Red rim, 
chrome crown, so white dome, etc. Yeah, this is fire. I, I definitely mess with it. Um, I didn't read the details on what it's based off of. I'm just going on strictly how the hat looks, etc. Not really the hook, but this is a fire hat side patch. I know it's busting in person, 100%. So this hat's definitely clean. Twins, I think this might be the most panic hat of the day. Um, you, you, you can never go wrong with a black crown, full black crown, and the logo is just going crazy with the metallic and the side patches. The, this hat is fire, 100%. This is the one for me. Hopefully I can secure it. I'm gonna be recording, so you're gonna see a YouTube video on it, but this hat is it green uv no gray or green i think i think it's gray but you know this has the one this has the 100 percent. and then you have the reds this reds is clean uh if you know he dropped a hat he dropped a pack with Capanova la Capanova la out in los angeles uh, he dropped the pack with them and it had and the theme was pretty much like you know the the, the blue and black and white for urbanton urbanton high school so Man, this, I guess this is a Lost Reds. That's what I'm gonna call it. I'm gonna call it a Lost Reds from that pack. The Lost Urban 10 Reds. This has fire. Metallic is busted. I know a lot of people are going for this too. So man, if you guys are in Jersey, ever wanna visit my fitness Patterson, definitely go be safe. Be safe. You know, look up the history of, Ur of uh, Patterson. Be safe. But if you're ever in that area, Definitely check it out. Hey, but if you are around June 10th, definitely come by, say what's up to me. I'm probably the tallest guy out there. I'll be wearing a White Sox hat. Definitely come out, say what's up. And hey, this is it, man. This is me talking about Patterson, me talking about New Jersey, me talking about my fitness. And that's it, man. You guys have a good one. I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.